Hey everybody, what's going on? Brendan Miller here back with another video. One of the things that I enjoy about making YouTube videos is the fact that I get to go find really cool spots, I get to catch really nice fish, and I get to share that exciting experience with you guys that watch my videos. With that being said, making YouTube videos is not nearly as glamorous as it looks. As a matter of fact, I would say it's not glamorous at all. It can be downright frustrating, it can be downright discouraging, it can be downright painful at times. Yes, I'm talking about physical injuries. These things are what is known as bloopers and fails, and I capture a lot of them in my pursuit to make fishing videos. And today, I'm going to show you some of those bloopers, some of those fails, some of this stuff has never been seen before on YouTube, so hopefully you enjoy. And we are crossing. Like I said, I'm not 100% sure how deep this river is, but so far, it doesn't feel too deep. Very sandy bottom though. All right, that's getting deeper. All right, that's deeper than I thought. Oh, the current's starting to pull me. Crud, 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 crud. Ah, uh, there's nothing but sand on the bottom, so I can't get any footing. And then the current's starting to pull me into that deep hole right there. Ah, uh, that's bad. All right, it's really sketchy because if I get into a deep spot, there's just nothing but a sand bottom, so there's no way to hold your footing. And the current's actually pretty strong out there, so it just starts to pull you downstream. Ouch. Oh, oh. <laughs> sorry about that. That's okay. So my rod just about got flung into the river. All right, so I was setting up the camera and my rod just about went in the river. I got him. This is like a good fish too. What the world, dude, that was insane. My rod just took off. Oh, this is a good fish. Good fish, nice pike. Oh my word. This is a, this is a huge fish. Oh my word, dude. This is, this is a massive pike. All right, guys, I'm kind of freaking out. That's by far the biggest pike I've hooked out of here. Let's see if I can land him. All right, he's not done yet, he's not done yet. He came off. He literally came off. That is unbelievable. All right, so that was absolutely insane. I rolled up on this spot and I just tossed out the bobber real quick and I was messing around with the GoPro getting the camera set up. I see the bobber go down, so I grab this camera and trying to get a shot of the bobber as it's you know going down and all of a sudden my rod just flies and almost ends up in the river. Thankfully, I happened to grab it and reel up, and I had the fish on for a decent amount of time, but I think, but again, I must not have gotten a good hook set on him, uh, and uh, yeah, he eventually popped off. I had him close to the shore a couple times, I was getting ready to grab him, and he popped off. That is maddening, but also very, very exciting and insane. I'm glad I got that on camera. After all that effort, the fish came off. Nice. Alrighty guys, so I feel a little bit like an idiot. I'm currently back here in the boondocks trying to fish this creek right behind me, which is turning out to be a disaster. But nevertheless, um, it's late summer and it has been very, very wet. We've had rain for I don't know how many days now. Everything's soaking wet, it's even raining right now. And guess what is eating me alive back here? Mosquitoes. I am being eaten alive back here by mosquitoes. And the terrible thing is, I left my bug spray in the car, I did not bring it with me, and now I'm literally going to have to cancel my fishing trip, cut it short, because I cannot stand to, to, to stay still here because there's so many mosquitoes just eating me alive. This is a fail. It's terrible, I have a nice backpack right here full of all kinds of camera gear, full of all kinds of lures, but I neglect to bring bug spray. And as a result, I'm going to have to cut this fishing trip short. Nice. That's my blood. I'm not gonna let these mosquitoes have it. Oh, got one. Got something. It's pulling good. What is this thing? Is that a wiper? Oh, it's a, yeah, it's a wiper, no way. Okay, cool. It's a good wiper. Yeah. Cool. Uh. Ah. 
Whoa, almost killed myself. That was sketch. We're good though. I was gonna say, if I lost control on these rocks. Oh my word, just like that. Oh, snap. Oh. Brothers and sisters, that hurt like crazy. Oh my word. Ouch. Oh. But I got a wiper. Look at that, that's a good one. Probably go five pounds. I didn't know this wiper even in here. It's a good fish right there. Out of the way, dude. Go. You're free. Ouch, my goodness gracious alive, boys. That was painful. Just tore my elbow up right here, and I got a headache, and my bum hurts, and I'm a little wet, but other than that, I'm okay. That could have been bad. I could have slammed my head against that rock, but thankfully I didn't. I knew that was gonna be a little hazardous coming down that steep, wet slope of rocks right there, but oh, I think we got it. All right, that was interesting. So guys, there you go. Those have been some of my recent fishing fails and fishing bloopers that I have encountered over the last couple of months while I've been making YouTube videos. Hopefully you guys enjoyed those. Hopefully you got a chuckle out of them. Hopefully you got a laugh out of them. I know I enjoy seeing myself falling and failing and making mistakes. It's actually pretty hilarious. If you guys wanna see more videos like this in the future, definitely let me know down in the comments below. And if you wanna support the channel, be sure to check out the links in the video description. Thank you so much for watching. And as always, stay hooked. I'll see you later.